You're watching BBC World News. I'm Babita Sharma. The headlines this hour. The authorities in Washington have used tear gas on protesters outside the White House as President Trump warned he'll deploy the army to end the violence triggered by the death of the unarmed African-American George Floyd. In Philadelphia, the U.S. Democratic presidential candidate Joe Biden said black communities already hard hit by the economic and health fallout of the coronavirus pandemic were being victimized and their cries of anger were being ignored. President Trump is facing a backlash over visits he made to two religious landmarks in Washington. The President and the First Lady Melania Trump visited the St. John the Paul II National Shrine in Washington, as well as St. John's Episcopal Church. And in other news, Dr. Abdullah Abdullah, who's leading the Afghan government's peace talks with the Taliban, has told the BBC that the organization is yet to cut all ties with al-Qaeda.